What's going on, man? What's happening? It's your man, Buddy Rogers. Welcome back to the channel. Today is Flashback Friday, so we booting up the PS3, and we throwing in Madden 25, and we trying to get a victory today. If you are new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, ring the bell for notifications, smash that like for me, and let's jump into it, man. Yesterday was Thanksgiving. Hope your holiday went well. Hope you got to see the fam. Hope you got some grub in you, because, man, 2020 has been a very, very very weird year a lot of people were lost due to well y'all know what's going on but it's a lot of things to be thankful for i'm definitely thankful to still be here that's for sure but hey man it's madden 25 we got rg3 and the washington football team as they are presently known today but back then the washington redskins and we're going to be taking on the new york football giants and the goat slayer himself mr eli man and mr two-time super bowl champion and let's jump into it man first down and 10 from the 41 handoff goes to wilson he's gonna take that for a gain of one now second down and nine eli manning dropping back and that's gonna be manning to myers he's gonna have about gain of four right there now third down and five from the 46 yard line manning is gonna find randall on the left side of the field he's gonna take it before he gets out of bounds for a first down and here we go third down and six looking to find victor cruz and he will not find victor cruz at all as fletcher comes in bats it down throws that pass into the grass get that out of here mr ghost slayer not today sir and here we go rg3 coming out on the field first drive of the game for the washington redskins and that is a pass to Santana Moss. He's going to take that for a gain of eight. Now, second down and two. Minute and 30 left to go in the first quarter. And we're going to give that to Big Al. Alfred Morris. He's going to have a short gain, but it's going to move the chains for us. Now, second down and 10 out of the pistol. Looking and finding Fred Davis on the sideline. And that's a great catch, man. First down, gain of 19. First and 10 from the 49-yard line. Now, Griffin. Rolling out, looking for his man, will not find Pierre Garçon at all. Gonna throw it right to Antrell Roll. He's gonna have his first interception of the game, and they're gonna give the ball back to the New York Football Giants, who have way too much time on first and 10, and he's gonna find Knicks for a gain of 17, moving the chains. Now, from the 36-yard line, handoff goes to Wilson, and he runs his man flat over. Excellent spin move past the 30, 20, 15, 10, 5, and he's gonna take that in for the score, man. What a run david wilson on fire early in the game and we got got to look at a replay of that man shanahan is not happy whatsoever coughlin looks pretty happy to say so myself and i never understood why they why they didn't have uh headsets on in this game i don't i don't get that but they just stand on the sideline they don't they don't call plays they don't they don't do anything like that they don't communicate <laughs> i never understood that man but that was a great Great run by David Wilson, who takes it in for a touchdown. Kick is up. Kick is good. They're going to add on an extra point. And the New York football Giants lead here in the second quarter. Seven to nothing. David Wilson, three carries, 68 yards, one touchdown. Come on, man. We got to get it together. We got to get some defense going. And speaking of the defense, Joseph is going to come through the middle and sack Bob Griffin the third. Now, second down and 16, we're going to find Santana Moss, and we're going to get those yards back and then a little bit more. Now, Griff on the keep, going to run it up to the 50-yard line, and that's a gain of 15 for Bob Griff. Let's move those chains for Washington, and let's keep it going. Looks like we're going to have an injury out here on the field as Paul goes down with a pinched nerve in his neck what man hopefully he'll be all right hopefully he'll come back to the game but it's all good man we're gonna keep it rolling and unfortunately we're not gonna keep it rolling at all tuck comes in gets the sack and that's gonna bring us to the two minute warning with the giants on top seven to nothing and once again another sack where's my offensive line did they did they leave are they still there and we're going to find Davis on a quick pass up the middle. He's going to gain most of those yards back. Going to give us 27 on the pass. Fourth down and three. And we going for it. We got Big Al back there. Short yard position. And we're going to get that right there 
right now. Moving the chains for Washington down to the 36 yard line. Another handoff goes to Morris and he's gonna take that for a gain of 12. 40 seconds left to go as he picks up that first down. Giants still on top seven to nothing and we'll call our first timeout to stop the clock. Now, 34 seconds left, gonna find Hankerson on the backside of the field. He's gonna pick up a gain of eight and Paul is gonna be escorted to the back. That's not looking good for him. It is what it is though, man. Next man up, as you already know. Now, gonna find Morgan on third and two, and he's gonna take that down to the one yard line. First and goal, handoff goes to Big Al. Big Al's gonna run that in. Easy score for Washington. Definitely needed that before the half though. Gotta tie up the ball game. Kick is up, kick is good. And 11 seconds left to go here in the first half as we take a look at some of Big Al's stats, man. Five carries, 24 yards. One of them went for a touchdown. And New York isn't going to try anything dumb before the half. Just going to hand it off to Wilson. He's going to lose a yard. And that's going to take us to the close of the first half. New York football Giants 7. Washington 7 as well. All knotted up. And here we go. Sending Paulson into motion as we hand the ball off to Big Al. And he's going to take that for a gain of 4 to start off the half. Now Griffin dropping back. Looking for a man. Fine Garcon over the middle. And he's going to have that for a nice gain of 23 up to the 49 yard line but he's injured on the play and I hope he can come back to the game because we don't need a player like him to be out pass goes to Davis he's gonna take that for a gain of seven and we are gonna move the football now quick toss to Morris spin move Woo -wee. Morris is out there running man hey <laughs> Morris is out there running now if we can get this passing game going We'll be all right. But hey, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. So we're going to hand the ball back off to Morris on first down and 10. And he's going to pick up a gain of seven, eight carries, 56 yards, one touchdown in the ball game so far. And now third down and two, going to hand it off to Morris once again. He's going to pick up a gain of five. And let's move those chains for the Washington football team. Now coming out in the pistol play action, going to find Pierre Garcon right over the middle and Garcon will take that in for a six as the Washington football team continues the momentum from the last bit of the first half into the second half gonna make it 14 to 7 Washington here in the third quarter with 51 seconds left to go now first and 10 for the goat slayer he's gonna hand it off to Wilson and he's gonna pick up a gain of four now second down and six Manning is gonna find Myers he's gonna have that for a first down and that is gonna bring the third quarter to a close only one quarter left to go we're still on top 14 to 7 right here at FedEx field and now First and 10 for Manning, looking, finding his man, but he is out of bounds, did not get both feet in, and let's go, man. Second down and 10, Manning to Myers once again, and he is gonna move the chains just like he did on the last pass that he caught. Now, third down and 10, here we go. Looking, and he will find absolutely no one. Riley comes down the middle, untouched, gets to the quarterback, Nice sack, man. Three minutes left to go in a ball game. First down and 10. We're going to hand that off to Morris. He's going to pick up a gain of six. Now, here we go. Third and four. Going to switch up the play a little bit. Didn't like what I was seeing on defense. And now Griffin's not going to have a man open. Got to throw it away. Otherwise, we would have lost a lot of yards on that play. That'll bring up fourth and four. And that'll get the ball back to the Giants. Now, first and 10, Manning with a whole lot of time, man. He was doing his taxes back in the pocket just now. That's going to be a nice gain of 10. Second down in inches. And it's Myers once again who picks up the first down for the Giants. Second down in 13. If somebody could guard him, I would be very appreciative manning to wilson will not catch that one almost got an interception on that play man they lucky on that one pass goes out to myers once again and he's gonna gain nine on the play and the giants will call timeout with one minute and 35 seconds left to go in the ball game now fourth and four finds his man has the ball but cannot catch the pass 
hit jars it out and we're gonna toss this one out to morris as we get the ball back on first and 10 from the 40 yard line and he is gonna take that for a huge gain moving it up into washington territory at the 35 yard line now if it ain't broke don't fix it once again morris on the toss past the 15 past the 10 gonna take that all the way into the end zone and big al with a 35 yard touchdown run let's go washington gonna add that extra Extra point and here we go 21 to 7 with 1 minute and 19 seconds left to go in the ball game Morris is having himself a day man 13 carries 127 yards two touchdowns let's go man Manning though he's not trying to hear all that moving the football now Randall's gonna take that for a gain of seven on the sideline. Now, second and three, gonna find Myers once again. And I would really, really appreciate it if we could get somebody to guard Myers before the end of the game. That would be real cool. Pass goes out on second down and 10 to Victor Cruz. He gets molly whopped on the ground and it looks like we got an injury on the play hopefully he'll be all right but i don't expect him to come back into this game unless it was you know nothing too serious but i don't know man it, it definitely looks serious now passes goes out to myers and myers two straight catches one going out of bounds and one brings them to inside the five yard line now second down and goal from the three looking finding myers once again he had it but the hit jarred it out and thank you thank you that he did not get that touchdown now myers with another catch 20 seconds left to go here in the ball game fourth and goal Oh man, I thought we had got a penalty right there. Looks like we didn't. Manny is gonna find his man in the back of the end zone and they are waving it off. I don't know what happened. We are gonna have to look at this replay, man. Pass goes to the back. It looked like he's wide open. Oh, wow. No toe drag swag at all for the Giants. We are gonna hand the ball off and that is gonna bring the game to an end. Thank y'all for stopping with me and rocking with me here on Flashback Friday. Tom Cloughlin, he's not having it. He, he don't like what he's seen out there. I, I, I don't blame him at all. <laughs> but we had to get the dub. You already know how we doing this, man. Shout out to Big Al. 14 carries, 139 yards, two touchdowns with a long of 35. But again, I appreciate y'all stopping with me, rocking with me, man. Make sure y'all hit the like. Make sure you hit the subscribe. Ring that bell for notifications. Stay up to date. And I will see y'all next Friday with another episode of Flashback Friday. Yeah.